Caitlin Pavey is an 18-year-old senior at Lanesville High School. I like hanging out with my friends. I like to be outdoors all the time, and um, I like to go fishing. A seemingly normal kid, but an incredible athlete. Did you ever think that she'd be playing collegiate softball one day? <laughs> uh, honestly, no. <laughs> I mean, uh, when, you're, when you have a child's born, you're thinking, man, I just want to have her healthy, and I want her to enjoy playing sports. Um, to excel in sports and to get a college offer, she had six offers. And to do that, it's pretty special. Sure, plenty of high school athletes get full rides and go on to play college ball, but Pavey's accomplishment goes far beyond her peers. Do you feel like you have a disability? No, I don't. Um, I don't think it's called a disability because it's not. I'm able. Disability is not a disability. You're able to do anything you want to. They call her Lefty. I had just moved her to the left-hand side of the box, and she thought it was because she was hitting left-handed. I called her Lefty because she was missing her left arm. Pavey was born with focal melia, a defect in which babies are born with underdeveloped or missing arms or legs. She has a left arm with two digits just below the elbow. Not that her game ever shows it. I have something what's called a glove transfer, and I have my glove on my right hand, so when I catch the ball, I tuck it underneath my arm and grab it and throw. Her transition from catch to throw is 0.2 seconds slower than players with two able arms. Do you think you put in more hours of work than the average softball player that you know that's your age? I feel like if I had two arms like a regular person that I wouldn't push myself as to be like as good as I am now. Like I have to work extra hard to be where I'm at and I want to be the best. So that's why I had to work hard. And her work goes well beyond the diamond. I learned about this camp called Nubability, and I go there to teach other kids with limb differences how to play. And they taught me like to embrace my arm and to like show people that anything's possible. God gave her a platform. I mean, let's just face it. I mean, he gave her a platform, right, wrong, and different. Uh, he gave her a platform, and I hope she used it to the best of her ability. I tell everybody, like, if you have a setback or you have something that you think you can't do, don't, because every setback is preparing you for a major comeback. Katie George, WDRB Sports.